actually driving it down the road, which is uh, really awesome. I'm headed to Coleman Auto Rebuilders right now, the headquarters of it. And uh, this is, uh, he helped us finish the Gambler up in the last video, but uh, like he hasn't got to see it during the day, so it's gonna be, it's gonna be really cool to get his reaction of what it looks like during the day. So hopefully he is, uh, hopefully he's outside. We're gonna be pulling up to the, uh, like I said, we're gonna be pulling up to the headquarters. I'm gonna try and catch his reaction. So maybe this will be pretty cool. What you think? Dude, that is sick. Oh man. Let's just, let's go run it through the pond. <laughs> That's awesome, man. Oh man, I can't wait to do some wheeling in that thing, man. That is sick, man. You guys did a killer job of that thing, dude. What's been going on? What's up, dude? What's up? How are you? Good. Good. Man, I've killed it. Finishing up the final touches of sort of the final touches of the car before the race tomorrow. The race starts very early in the morning and we've got almost all the stickers on it. Sean's been up for like 36 hours. <laughs> <laughs> we've got the Making Cars Great Again sticker and It does look good in the video. It does. The Coleman Auto Rebuilder sticker. On the hood. Then we come over here and we got this one that you've seen in the video already. This thing looks so good. It's like a rally, it's like a rally car. It really is. Next one already. You hadn't been done this one. <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> so I think we're gonna go another round and ride in the trails and stuff like we did earlier. Um, we shall see you guys in the morning. I'm gonna vlog the whole uh, trip tomorrow, and we got two days of trip, so I may have to break it in parts, or I may do it in just a big movie. Could be just a big movie. If, otherwise, we'll see you guys tomorrow morning. Peace. All right, so that's the day of, and we've got our stuff packed in the end of the vehicle. It's
it's around 6.42 right now. Uh, we're at a gas station. Josh is inside getting some drinks and food for today. I packed my stuff. Austin should be on his way to Dylan's, and then we'll be on our way in a few. We're just letting him grab some food and drinks. And uh, yeah, we'll be at Dylan's in a few minutes. So, we come down the back way to Dodge City, which is, uh, I don't remember, I don't know what this road's called, I can't remember. But the bridge is out. I don't know if you can see that from here, but the bridge is out. So we're waiting on Josh to message, instead of going all the way back to freaking Good Hope and going to Golf Course Road to go to Dodge City, I'm gonna ask Josh if we can use his driveway I'm um, just waiting on him to message back. His driveway actually goes from this road to Dodge City, but you have to like go through, you know, everything. Right? His like his old yard. So I gotta make sure before I do it. I don't want to just do it and Dad come out and get mad or something like that. <laughs> but yeah, this is the predicament we're in right now. Going out of the mound here, like. All right, we've made it. We got Dylan. We haven't made it yet. We haven't made it to the gambler, but we have <laughs> Dylan. We have Austin. Let me drive. You've been abusing this thing. Uh, hush. I have not been abusing this thing. Alright. We're at Stony. We made it. In the gambler. We're fishing to go check in. YouTuber. Hang on. <laughs> Filmer. <laughs> Should be working right now. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, you're sure down. Look at that. <laughs> Dealer tag on
check in as soon as we get there. Those people just got engaged. Congratulations. So this is the first checkpoint in this gambler. I guess it's I guess it's well, I guess it's the first checkpoint. Dylan walked way down that way. Excuse me. All the the guys over there. Mm -hmm. Oh, those are the people who crossed the bridge. Are we gonna have to cross the bridge? Uh, probably. We're probably gonna have to climb back up and then cross the bridge. Oh, that's cool over there, that rock wall. Yeah, same way. There's 
water going into his car. Oh yeah, he's fixing to flood it. Go ahead and zoom in on this. Look at all that water flowing yeah. into the door. It's so good. <laughs>
Dylan like straddled it all the way through. Look at that. How deep it is right there and, now. Uh, He knows how to put on a show. I gotta build a Civic. I've got to build an off road Civic. I swear, I'm gonna build something off road this time. Uh, that stuff is sloshy, dude. It's still stuck up there, dude. Oh, wow. Hey, will he be able Here to make go, it? Tank. Will he be able to make it? Oh, yeah, he should. Through that good. car? Oh, yeah. Oh, 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 yes. <laughs> no. It's close. Oh, it's too heavy. Yeah. Yes, they did. Look how thick that load is. I know. Oh, no. Tell him to turn his wheel straight. Send it! I think he's worried about hitting that car.
I thought I was like, okay, we're just oh, how many we Fuck. <laughs> 
Made it to like the stop. Uh, we're stopping and eating lunch here, and we're gonna do two more checkpoints. Everybody's pretty exhausted, which is wild. <laughs> Looks like I'm jumping in with you. He dropped his bumper up here. I did? Yeah. I'm gonna pull up and grab it. Here, I get it. Oh, and his tag. And his bones. I got it. <laughs> I got your bumper. <laughs> I was wondering what all that crazy noise was. That's awesome. <laughs> oh, goodness. All right, well, we lost our bumper, guys. Yeah, you try to rip these LEDs off for you. <laughs> Shit. Uh, pocket knife or something cut them off yeah i don't know all right That's however you want to do well, it we're gonna figure out something new with this real quick and then uh we'll keep going on the trail <laughs> i was like what is all y'all notice that red corvette passes <gasps> yeah i seen that earlier yeah i was like, I was like driving couldn't see that everybody freaked out it's like, red corvette what are the odds i was like what <laughs> Somebody said, let me hear your best ye. <laughs> <laughs> the first year that was a 
his bumper fell off. <laughs> I had to jump back. <laughs> Was that cool? Dale. Am I recording? <laughs> <laughs>
It's because it's your rear tire is flexing and catching the body panel. Oh. It's not allow it's not allowing you to go. We're gonna come oh, up crap. here and try to pick it up a little bit. This hill's freaking Wait, you want me to go from here? If you can. Just just just, you just punch it, yeah. Just punch it. Oh, maybe break up. Like yeah. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> that is sketchy on the other side. That was, <laughs> that was fucking awesome. Teamwork. Make the dream work. Wow. Sounds like your ass fucking running up that hill. Think I'll make it? <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's awesome. Alright, let's go. Let's do it. Hell's dope, dude. Best punch for the buck. Yeah, get that no part. The dude's like, uh slide all the way down the sink. Oh no. This is level. Hey Sean. Hey. hey Dylan. Hey Austin. So we uh, he blew a heater hose and we had to fix it. Or Dylan uh, gave him some assistance in fixing the heater hose. And uh, we thought it was a vacuum leak, but it turned out to be that. He didn't have any antifreeze in his in his motor. But uh, we got 110 points. Yep. We're doing pretty good so far. He's got his stuff fixed. There's a Subaru as of right now. <laughs> I've got a 
the uh, snorkel came off earlier, so we had to self tap screw it back in. It fell off. We caught it when it fell off, too, which is wild. We sent it and we're like, no, we're going to send it. <laughs> They're slightly mangled over there. <laughs> you going to hit it? I'll, I'll go over it. <laughs> go over it. You didn't ramp it until you got over it and then whenever you hit it your car bounced and then got airborne <laughs> <laughs> you you went in the air after the fact yeah, me and him was both like did you see that <laughs> i got a side by side said, said you stuck gonna be a hell of a drop too.
with ease. Came out with ease. <laughs> Super. That car's great again. Not yet. You can do it now. But he's holding on to the rope. Takes off. <laughs> he's holding on to it. Thought he get held on to it. <laughs> I'd be suing. <laughs> Traffic jam? Yeah. <laughs> There's one of everything up in here.
Look at this side, Sean. Sean, look at this side. Sean, come look at this side. Dude, we got a CRX coming to pull us out. Oh my god, dude. Look at that. <laughs> look at this CRX. This thing is dope. We haven't seen you stuck all day. This is our first time. We've already, we've already done the whole gambler and everything. This is the first time getting stuck. Almost made it. Z6. Sorry guys, I keep looking away. Don't mind me, I'm just hanging out. <laughs> <laughs> Making cars great again. This definitely made this car great, that's for sure. Hey man, they showing ways live, go watch it. <laughs> And I'm also recording a video too. Yeah. All right, we're ready when you are. So close, so close. Why'd it die? The battery come undone? Hold up. Let me check the battery. Oh, it came off the post. Put it, put it back on. You got it? We'll fix it as soon as you get out. Yeah. It just came off. Oh, man. <laughs> 
Simba. <laughs> Back off. Dude, what? Do it to me. Do it to one of them. Please do it. That'll go half Yeah, just do it to their forehead Look right here. Look at that. That is insane. First time I've ever seen that. That's the first time I've ever seen a little Civic pool thing in a pool car around like that. Early 90s. Hatchback. Hey, let's put that uh, batter back. Hey, I'll see. He needs to stay on that side. You can see we done lost the bumpers from all the mud weighing it down. I took them off. <laughs> Jesus. Come back up it to get us. Yeah, come back up here. We all gotta slide down it. <laughs> oh yeah, that went bad. Nuh-uh. Slid all the Didn't way down. How fast how rocky it was to stop. <laughs> I need to stop to pick us up. <laughs> Are you stop? Let's get in. <laughs> oh. I didn't want to walk it all the way down. wanted to give a uh, quick shout out to our sponsor today it's Coolman Auto Rebuilders as you can tell his logo you could see it everywhere in my videos especially at Dylan's house because Dylan's one of his mechanics the this sponsor specializes in selling late model vehicles uh, cars and trucks and they've been professionally repaired you know saving you money without sacrificing quality all of their clean lake model repairable vehicles are hand-picked and purchased from insurance salvage auctions sources in the southeast some vehicles are even purchased by automotive dealers shops and direct individuals this is their Facebook page right here I can sit here and tell you all day long of how 
good of a job this dude is, but you can see it in the reviews. Like, you just go to the reviews here and it'll just it, use a five out of five rating. And it's just endless reviews of how nice and organized and how great the cars were. It's just, it's insane of the, the great feedback that Jonathan, the owner of this company, gets with this sort of company. Really good, really good dude. And I'm so happy to be able to shout him out in my videos, it's, it's, especially as the YouTube channel is as small as it is. And he went out on a limb and sponsored this this video series that we're doing with the Gambler, and I really do appreciate it. And I know Dylan appreciates it too. He also has an active website and an active Instagram. If you would like to get on there and check those out, you can get on the website and it shows inventory. Uh, you can contact the dealer. Uh, just all kinds of stuff. The website is built very very well. It's very user friendly. Purchasing a vehicle is even easier. He has loads of vehicles in stock ready to go and has plenty more that are coming into the inventory. Like I said, I really do appreciate you sponsoring this video series that we're doing with The Gambler. I hope we do frequently get you as a sponsor even more, so I really do appreciate it, Jonathan. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you want to check out his social medias and the website, or if you're interested in purchasing a car and want to figure out how to get in touch with him, just check out the links below. I'll link the company's website and Facebook page and Instagram stuff so you can actually get in touch with him. He's very active and will frequently answer your questions that you might have.